Hi, I'm Skylar. If you'd like to convert a PDF to an EPUB for reading on your iPad, there's an application for the Mac and for Linux and PC called Calibre. Let's take a quick look at it. So it says calibre-ebook.com and let's look in the frequently asked questions. So it supports the PDF format, but if you look a little bit down here, it says I converted a PDF file, but the result has various problems. And they say PDF is a terrible format to convert from. And they go on to explain all of the different things that can go wrong. They make a really good case that uh, converting a PDF is just not really a good idea. You're going to end up with page breaks in funny places, hyphenations. You're going to lose any sort of formatting that the author intended. It's just really not going to end up as a good experience. So what do you do instead? Well, I recommend an application called Goodreader. It's a couple bucks from the App Store, but here's what it looks like. So I've got a book here in PDF format. I'm going to open it up. And at first, it looks really busy. There's a lot going on on the screen. But if you tap in the center, all that stuff goes away. And tapping on the sides changes pages. What you'll notice right away is that you can zoom in and tap to, to go to the next page. And it doesn't change the zoom. That's something that iBooks doesn't do. And that's the primary reason someone would want to convert a PDF. This feature alone makes Goodreader really great for reading long PDFs without having to reformat them. You can also do all sorts of great things in Goodreader, like add annotations, bookmarks, etc. So, in my personal opinion, I think spending $4.99 on an application designed to give you uh, flexibility and readability for PDFs is a better bet than going through the rigmarole of converting them to EPUB. Thanks for watching. I'm Skyler.